it's time to put our newly acquired knowledge to work. Let's use Groover, who is a hierarchy object, glued up object, and let's see what it takes to actually make him animate, make him run. I'm sure you've noticed that I'm quite fond of using the three axis manipulation tool. By right clicking on the selection sphere we can replace that with the rotation diamonds on the bounding box for the object. It's just as simple or just as easy to use these uh, for the whole object or for subgroups. It's just a matter of preference whichever you feel most comfortable with. I personally am more comfortable with the three axis tool so that's what I'm going to be showing. You have also seen me use the selection sphere to select the parts or subgroups of an object to manipulate. Simply by moving the sphere around close to the objects that you want, you can select just those groups for manipulation. And then using my three axis tool, I can rotate strictly on the x axis, z axis, or the y axis. And although TrueSpace is extremely intelligent on allowing you to use the selection sphere to select the different subgroups in the hierarchy, it sometimes can get confused on a complex object. Um, it can be difficult to pick out every small little detail. In that instance, uh, let's select the whole object and let's use the down arrow short, uh, keyboard shortcut on the keyboard and down arrow will step down one level in the hierarchy. In this instance, this selects from the waist down on our, on our Groover model. And we can use the rotation tool then to rotate and, and locate that particular object. A left or right arrow key on the keyboard will then select the next group on that same level of the hierarchy. In this instance is upper part. So it's very easy to become familiar with. Up and down arrow keys step you up and down through the levels. Left and right arrow keys will step you through the objects of that level or subgroups. Here I've been able to use the arrow keys to navigate to Gruber's head and be able to rotate him very easily on all three axes again. Up arrow key as I mentioned, pressing it twice takes us to the top level again of the hierarchy. With that said, let's, uh, let's make Groover run.